Dina and Mark, good evening. Jonathan Mills was a scorer and a great rebounder. Today he had plans to practice basketball at his former high school, but he never made it. Today, 26-year-old Jonathan Mills, a former standout high school basketball star, was shot and killed. It happened here not far from his former school, North Lawndale College Prep. According to police, this afternoon around 1.30 in the 4100 block of West Roosevelt Road, Mills was shot multiple times. Witnesses say Mills was leaving a convenience store when he was gunned down. He was pronounced dead at the scene. The shooting happened on the same block where Alderman Michael Scott has an office. This woman who lives in the area told us she feels like the neighborhood is under siege. It happened right across the street at the Alderman's office, you know. It seemed like, you know, something should have been done. Okay, I know there's plenty of cameras around here, you know, to solve this, just as well as other people's out here to saw it too. In 2009, Mills led the North Lawndale Phoenix to the public league title. Beast on the boards, <laughs> you know playing good basketball. That's all I know him for is basketball, his energy out there, and everybody wanted him to play for him. Later he attended Southern Mississippi University and then went on to play for the Chicago Fury of the Midwest Basketball League. Uh, he was just back home, man. You know, when you grow up, where you come from, you know, you like to come back home sometimes and obviously sometimes coming back home is not where you need to be. Regardless of this, nobody needs to lose their life. No, nobody needs to lose their life or whatever it may be. It's just sad. It's a sad day here in Chicago. I know for the basketball world, it's just sad. Mills' coaches said today he is one of the best rebounders to ever come out of Chicago, and he was a great guy. Reporting live to Mon Bradley, WGN News.